Hello everybody, welcome to Red Tool House and our YouTube channel. We talk about all things homesteading and try to implement some of those things in our rural 100 acres here in southern West Virginia. Well today is loading day, or it's loading evening, and it's time to get those seven pigs on this trailer. Um, just pulling up on the side by side, they came tearing down off the hill, rushed into the corral here because I've been feeding them here the past several days. So we should be able to close the gate behind the corral and hopefully sort them out. Close the back gate. Okay, so what I'm doing right now is putting a little food in the trailer to draw them in. Now the real trick is to see if they've banked too much mud up against my fence, my gate. We need a little more rain in here to make this more entertaining. Hello, swine. Okay. Do this chain. Did you get your pig face out of the way? to convince you to go this way. Come on. Come on. Buddy leave. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, no, no. No! Curse you, vile swine. I cast mild insults in your direction. Nope. <laughs> One person. That's all I needed. One person. You don't have one person because you're a one man farm. Yip, pig, 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 pig. Yip, pig, 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 pig. Yip, pig, 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 pig. Yip, pig, 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 pig.
Well, that was exciting. Um, for those of you keeping score, that's six in the trailer, one out on pasture. And um, infrastructure failure. So who's the biggest hypocrite on Red Toolhouse? This guy is. So yeah, so my cheap pipe gate in the back that had been compromised and I fixed it last year, but obviously failed again. So my biggest sow or biggest biggest pig was able to push through it. So that's the one that stressed out the most because it obviously had to blow the gate and everybody else just went on through. So they came back easy, the one that blew the gate standing over here in the pasture. So we're all just going to chill out. We've got six loaded and locked and uh, hopefully so-and-so gets lonely and we'll just see if she ends up wandering in here. We'll draw her in with some more food. This is where no matter how much infrastructure you have, help would be great. If I had one person standing by that gate just to turn them around, it would have been fine. But it is what it is. So I was able to coax her back into the barn and once I got her into the barn here, I just did everything I could to barricade this busted gate. You can see how it's just absolutely destroyed. Again, this is a bad area. This corner here is a spring that we just cannot get to drain. A, because of the pig traffic, so it, it keeps tearing up my ditch line. So we're going to redo all of this. But uh, got her trapped in there, hanging out in the barn. I waited till Kelly and the boys came home. And uh, with their help, we were able to get her loaded. And it was after dark, so obviously video wasn't going to show up well. But uh, we got her packed away and ready to go.